What's going on guys, it's Oink here, and I'm bringing you a uh, Team Tactical Domination game here. And for those of you that don't play Team Tactical, it's like, um, kind of like Mosh Pit, but for teams of four. So it's 4v4, and you get stuff like Domination, Capture the Flag, Team Deathmatch, that kind of stuff. It's a pretty good playlist, but again, if you're in a big party, you, well, you can't really get into it. Um, but yeah, I'm bringing you some sniping gameplay. Gameplay, yeah. I'm giving you some sniping gameplay with this one. Um, generally, I wouldn't be sniping uh, when I'm playing as part of a team, just because I don't feel that it complements playing as part of a team. But I really wanted to get some good practice in, um, and yeah, I just I just felt like sniping, so I decided that I'd. I'd play the objectives even though I was using a sniper which doesn't really go hand in hand but you'll see at the end I do get some decent objective scores um, as well as a nice a nice kill death ratio so it's a pretty cool game it's pretty much all quick scoping as well uh, I do, I do kind of start off a bit badly there but I definitely get into the game and I, I think it's actually a, a really nice game in terms of some some good quick scoping and some good, good team play good objective objective playing as well so I'm running the L96A1 I also have the extended mags attachment just because I prefer the regular scope so I might as well have the extended mags if you see what I'm saying um, I'm going with mm, oh first perk I'm going with hardened um, and Ninja as I fall through the map oh Lightweight there we are so Lightweight Hardened Ninja are my perk setups I haven't got any of them pro I'm only about level 30 ish at the moment so I've only really I've been mixing them up and stuff so I haven't got any pro perks yet but that's not too bad I, I don't worry too much about that um, <coughs> oh, sorry. I'm running the UAV Ah, oh, the airstrike one was that napalm, and the attack helicopter, which actually does reasonably well in this game. Uh, I'm pretty terrible at the napalm strikes. I think I kill myself and that's it, or something terrible like that. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's a pretty nice gameplay, and these guys seemed pretty fun to play against because I could actually do. I don't know. A lot of times when I'm quick scoping and um, the other team's like quite good, I feel like I have to be properly on top of my game to get the shots away. With this team, I just felt comfortable running around and hitting the shots, and yeah, it was just it was a nice, a nice relaxed game. But I mean, what I wanted to say actually is um, I am working on my first Gran Turismo video, and for those of you that don't know. Uh, it's um, it's like an amazing game and I would suggest to you that if you like racing or anything then get it but it is a fantastic game and I decided I'm gonna sort of make a how do you put it like a advanced techniques sort of series so it's gonna be all about uh, tips and sort of tutorial style videos where I just go into more advanced techniques of the game and I do them one by one for each episode and uh, I'm going for a really nice high quality production value which means it's going to take a little while to edit I've been doing it for a day or so now um, and I'm making a bit of progress but it is slow and it's, it's hard work but I'm hoping that when it comes out it's going to be like properly top quality stuff and hopefully you guys will in, will enjoy it. And uh, so yeah, I mean that's going to be taking a few days now. The first episode for those of you that might be interested is on understeer and sort of like why it happens and how best to counter it. And that's pretty funny actually. My mate there, Crowhorn, was on top of the uh, the doors and he was like, Ah, RCXD, you can't get me up here. And then it just like drives around and blows him up. But yeah, that was uh, that was some nice amusement for me there. Um, hmm. But yeah, I mean, a grand judgment. Um, the other thing I have, I've got a couple series coming up, sort of. One of them was gonna be 
uh, actually is going to be a sort of uh, fortnight. I think it's going to be fortnightly sort of race. It's going to be like race of the fortnight sort of thing, and it's going to be <laughs> at least for the start. Me against my my friend is going to be like so. You guys can sort of see how different cars work, and what we're going to do is we're going to do like a head to head every maybe two weeks I, I'm, I'm not sure of the time scale yet and I'm gonna post the video up and you can just basically see who wins and loses each each two weeks and um, that'll be pretty funny uh, I might mix up who we do the driving with I don't know I haven't really thought entirely about that yet um, but yeah the other thing is um, someone mentioned in a comment on one of my videos that I should think about doing a montage <laughs> Because they liked my sniping, um, and that is actually got me thinking on doing a montage. So I've already got some nice clips, and I'm not the best of editors. Uh, I've said before, possibly that I can make a video look nice, and uh, yeah, for like a commentary or a gameplay. But in terms of making a montage, you know, my my COD4 one was not bad. I thought it, it was sort of, you know, it wasn't uh, trashy, it was nice quality and uh, the transitions were smooth, but it was not anything special. And I feel that my sniping ability in Black Ops is a bit greater. Uh, well, I don't know, not necessarily greater, but more impressive as a lot of people seem to not be able to snipe particularly well in Black Ops. So I feel that I will be able to get some mm, bigger stuff. For Black Ops, so I'm trying to find someone who is a good editor, maybe. Or if any of you guys know someone who's good at editing, or you are good at editing, just give me a shout on like a PM or something, or comment on the video, and I'll get back to you. Uh, but yeah, so that's that. Uh, the other thing is, um, what was I going to say now? I did have a good point to make. Hmm. Oh well, I'll come back to that another time if I do remember. But, I mean, there's about two minutes left here. And I think I get two nice kill streaks here that get me my chopper. And uh, getting kill streaks on this game with a sniper is so fun because it's like you know that you're such a you're at such a disadvantage that it's like yeah, I earned I earned this chopper much more than you earned your chopper. I don't know, I'm just really talking crap at the moment, but we get a nice triple cap here to uh, accelerate the speed difference. Uh, no, not accelerate the score difference, that's what I meant to say. But, I mean, oh, I have a funny gameplay, actually. It's on this same map, basically the very next game after this one. This is what I was going to say. The very next game after this one, uh, the people on the other team left, and uh, some other people came in, and for some reason, obviously, because they hadn't, they hadn't just played this map, they voted to play this map again, right? So we came back into this one, and um, it was domination again. But I'm going to make a little video of that. It's going to be really short, and it's quite amusing. So look out for that one. And other than that, guys, I will catch you in the next video. Oh, and the final score is 26 kills, 7 deaths, 3 caps, and 2 defends. So pretty nice all-round score there. Anyway, yeah, in a bit, guys.